Yo, hey, how's that? You don't really look like how certain we are. Eh, hey, forward. May I tell you, man, you know, hombre, if me and Kemi them never got you so much as you, me I want to fall out a long time in the dark. As Nanny and the Maroons did against the British in the 18th century, an understanding of their motivation, reasoning, and leadership skills are what we need in present times to make our change. I'm not sure I understand what you say. What one players have to do with that? The players isn't a physical thing, but a spiritual arrangement procedure. Just listen to the music accompanied by my voice. Shortly you will fall asleep. Once I knock the pans together, your spirits will awaken. In the year 1732, a critical time for Nani and her tribe. It work. It looks so. Uh, what do you for that? Most. I'm billboard there somewhere in the bush here. Yeah. yeah, what? Look at why it's dragon when we reach up and Mr. Chain Shop. Hi! You! Yo! Stop shh, it once! Shh. Oh, what up? Shit, dirty flat! I'm British. Got him! Bring that Negro here. I have to do something. I can't watch this. I can't do it. Fuck it. Where am I going? These lashes will teach you dirty black. Ah. Yeah, white right, boy. Hello, man. Uh. Yo. Woo. Yo, oh, yo. Yeah. I am Queen Nanny of the Maroons. Right in. I can't believe I really you. And you're really real. Yo, this mad dog. From where do you journey? And why place attack on Tanto? No, they help Tanto. Soldiers see me stop for us at river and journey back with message from Captain Kojo. They chase and whip Tanto. But these travelers, they help. Yeah, man, I help. Who did I help? They help Tanto. Talamane. What is Kodja's message? Nobody now go believe this in a dog, I swear. Nani. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to do one. I'm pray my woman still now, bro. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> there is problem. We must depart. Take the enemy's items. Thank you for Tanto's rescue. Be safe in your journey, travelers. Daff daff. We're not supposed to go with her. Eh, hey, but we can't just ask her, so. Come on, come on. Nanny, we can't come with you. Yes, we do need helping hands. Ah. Now, what are we for? Response phone to my health. Welcome to our village, Nani Town. We would have never find this man we want. This sick, this mad dog, real Jim. Yeah, what am I telling you? <laughs> <laughs> this is a free community. We live a free life. A lot of these villagers have felt the rough, cold hands of slavery. We rescue what slaves we can and bring them to join our tribe. We are motivated by our belief. The blacker the skin, the stronger the rebel. What do you mean? We are of darker skin than our enemy. 
So they treat us in terrible ways, but they use us to work because we are stronger than them. They beat us and lock us away from exploring, but if we escape, they cannot find us because we are smarter than them. The white man hates us because the black skin is strong. We fight and win even when outnumbered. Within the black skin, there is great strength and intelligence. We rebel to free our people and tell them of this power. Our enemies enslave and hide us from, trying to make us feel weak and worthless. But the blacker the skin, the stronger the rebel. Mud. Nanny, you return in a short time. We meet Tanto in his journey. He had trouble. But these travelers help. This is my brother, Kwau. Yeah, Mud. We have message from Kojo. We need a sit together now. Inform Tabumbum. Tanto, show the travelers through the village. Yes, Queen Nanny. This way, travelers. Talamane. Travelers, Nani Town is great village. Talamane. We grow what we eat, we farm our own food. Things like big fat pumpkin, yaman tomato, sweetest orange, cherry, and other fruits. Make nice, nice juice. Full up your belly. Mmm, Talamane. Traders from our village take some crops to market and trade for iron, cloth and other useful items. That is Nanny Town Library, where elders of our tribe spend most time as scribes. Mud. And this is clinic. We have bush doctors and nurses that treat our villagers. There is also school and bank. Our village has much great things, travelers. Nanny Town is best of all maroon villages. All? How much maroon village there? Two other villages, Queen Nanny's brothers, the warrior Captain Kojo's village, and the builder Kong Pong's village. Captain Kojo's village is six sunlight over Kowachi Courage Mountain and through Maka and Kasha Valley. The builder Kong Pong takes four sunlight down a Kumba Crocodile Lake and cross Mumba Wasbush. And you got you all of that barefoot and shirtless, my brother. A compound. A him make it four and clock. Eh. Yeah. Him did a builder. Yes, he's great builder. He builds pots and pans. Chair and table. Bed and dresser. Michael, we have a bad phone. Oh, I want to use my dresser. Dresser? Him carve giant queen nanny. In a great guango tree alive. Yo, this mud, you know. It looks just like nanny. This is Village Square, the heart of nanny town. Now let us walk to Big Longwood Palm Tree. No, no. Show one different tree, Tanto. The Bolita tree. I don't know what one of them is, but that sounds better. 
Hasta la mañana. Oi! Hey boy, I see man a daydream. I am here. You are not from a tribe. You and them in your strange covers. I am Kabaka. You journey from afar. Well far. I owe that. That is my steam fish and okra body wife, my friend. Eh, I say I go on around here. Yeah? I am Kabaka, my friend, a brave warrior. If you want a wife, my friend, a steam fish and okra body wife, you have to prove you are a brave warrior. Me already have a wife in a Kabaka. She just no know so we married yet. Oi! Oi! If you want her to know, you have to show her. You are a brave warrior, my friend. What is your name? Pookie. <laughs> that is not name of brave warrior. If you want her to be wife, you need brave warrior name. And covers of brave warrior. Don't worry, I help you become brave warrior. Then you fight giant junker to show bravery. Oh. Yo, them bolito snacks are bad tanto. Nah lie. We grow best crops. Real crops. Hold on. What that? Mr. Chin shop, tell him my name. Mr. Chin, I can see what I'm going on in here. So. I want one Chinese man to do this. So. Diversity. Diversity. He can't even pronounce it. Him there now, you soon see too much up up now. Better them sell cash pot. That a discrimination, dog. Tanto, them sell cash pot in ya. Cash pot? No, not have cash pot. But Mr. Chin sell peacock pot. Tell him, man. Peacock pot. Give one to ten peacock feather. And guess how much leaf in bag. When leaf count, if you're right, you win. If you play a super feather, you win enough more. You get rich. Real rich. I tell you, they not easy, you know. So a peacock fed your money? Most. You have none? How oh, you ask me? You have no feather tanto? Cheap peacock but I have to keep them. I give to my booby and my puppy them. Enough you to get man. More than by two numbers still. Seriously dog? Then no must. I can win sitting. Dog, seriously? Look on the bag. I between 29 and 36 leaf in there. You yeah, alright, my youth? You know, anytime I don't have no money, I'm miserable, my youth. I left my bill for the night van. But you still wouldn't have no peacock feather. Real money wouldn't work. A Chinese man, that. He not take any money. He's a little, so he can't see value. Just for the year, I next prejudice remark. I'm supposed to have five bills for me. I don't think that's going to work still. You don't know them my people are home, man. So Tanto, I want to do for entertainment about you. Entertainment? At sunlight we begin work. At middle of sun we continue work. But at end of sunlight we still work. Some work in moonlight while others rest. So they can work in sunlight. Alright. I mean like I want to do for fun though. Like I want to do for laugh and enjoy on yourself. We have entertainment time. The elders tell stories. We sing song, dance and play a game. Eat fruits, sweet potato and fish. We have great moments. 
you should come and see this moonlight. Alright. Yo, see a changer. Me buy super feathers and a dragon. What? Mmm, China man. Tanto, Queen Nanny wishes to see the travelers. We must go. The travelers, Queen Nanny. Where is the other? For real, a porky. We never know what this ain't gone. Tanto, find the other. Yes, Queen Nanny. Dalamani. Cause of haste to return. We did not get good chance to speak with you on Tanto's rescue. As you may see, Tanto is special to village. He is messenger. He travels great journeys with important items and messages. He has been messenger for many moons and has never been seen by our enemies. But on this sunlight for first he is seen. You are there to help. How is this? Huh? Why help Tanto? From where do you journey? The covers you wear are not of slave. Did the white man send you a spy? No, we are not a spy. If you are, we'll have to throw you down, the boiling pit of death. No, we are not a spy. If we explain this, maybe you don't believe. Speak. Well, Nanny, we are come from the future. We meet a man of descent from your tribe. He used some kind of magic and a four-hand clock to make a travel come here. I know. We come to meet you and wait. What? You know? I know. I just wanted you to say it. The traveler, Queen Nanny. Hey, boy, Tanta. When you see Nanny want to see me, I check see you. me alone, hombre. Where do my money are doing here? Thank you, Tanto. Give us time. Where I come from? And what that you got on? Nanny McQueen is sent for me? Yes, I must speak to you all. I told your company I know why you are here. Eh, so what kind of wedding you want? Big? Lake? I one of them backyard one day where I just me, you and the pastor. I recent had vision of three great rebels who journeyed beyond time with the will and strength of ten lions. In my vision, the rebels arrived during time of great need for our tribe. During time, we needed brave warriors to help in our fight against the enemies. Now is such a time and you arrive. The clock you speak of was built by my brother, a compound who has had the same vision of the three rebels. I believe you travelers are the three rebels. My brother Captain Koja has sent message. A Kong Pong was tricked and captured by the whites along with Ado, a member of our village. In our luck, the whites brought them to Paul Smith Plantation. It is short journey from our village. We will free them from captive and you are destined to join us. This is truth to our vision. Will you join us? That sounds so superstitious, Nanny. But with everything we experience, it makes sense. What do you say? Yeah, man. Maybe I really this will come for you. Okay, what do you say? Okay. Hey, man. I alone can go do it for Nanny. And here, yeah, don't come up okay front of Nanny, you see me? From now on, my name is Paul and Doko. Paul and what? <laughs> Paul and Doko. <laughs> All right, Paul and Gummy. All right, Nanny, we are going to join you. This is good. We leave before sunlight. Tanto shall show you to your hut. We speak later, Rebels. Rebels, this is your hut. That is where you rest. 
That is where you wash your skin and change covers. That is where you listen to Wavebox, another of Akong Pong, the builder's inventions. Wavebox, how that work? Just turn on and hear all village news. In other news, two white men die last moonlight at Crocodile Lake. <laughs> The white man is so silly. Check I go now, Rebels. Remember entertainment time. This moonlight. Ah. So I know. I don't even know. I'm still kind of confused about what we're supposed to achieve, yes, sir. I'm not sure I'm not dying, dog. Can I send you to a youth and the youth send you to come here? All of this I must really part of a plan to make things better. All we do is just go and play with it. Pokey seems to take it serious though. I look him a look, Nanny. You know, see, my man say his name Paul and Tully. I saw a lot of chat, man, when they're not about. What? I really look here, look, Nanny. My you, I not look, Nanny. Oh! I pursue, Nanny. What? A woman like Nanny, hombre. You have to marry that second young with. So it a work? If war work, your pursuit. Oh, you mean if it work? You know, see how Nanny a pray me. She a wonder how a Polando could they her whole life. Or she a wonder how him fit in that pants there. <laughs> <laughs> and I hate that, you know. After me see every man, the man proposing to see what I go on. Do what? Why if? Yeah, what? no man asks me nothing else. I go wash my skin. Man, them free up his hut now. Why if? Man, them. <laughs> <laughs>